I couldn't believe it. Imelda's key opened my father's box. I dreaded what I was going to find in... It was a photograph of Imelda. But why here? I felt as if a black hole had swallowed me up. Imelda and Carchon grinning. While behind them a village was being razed to the ground. Its people butchered. And there, next to them, staring out at me across the years, my own father. There was a letter. I feared there was... Hotel St. Georges, Algiers, Friday. My darling Thierry, by the time you read this, you'll be safely out of Africa. You need not fear. Pierre and the organization do not know who you are really working for, or about us. Did you think I would betray you? I could not. You wanted me to leave him, but I don't have your courage. I know too much of what has been going on here. They would find me and they would kill us both. Enjoy your life in Paris, Thierry. Your life of honor, of patriotic duty. Do they give medals to spies? No, they'll just give you a funny job in an embassy somewhere. I could never share that with you. Imagine me, a diplomat's wife. So I must stay here with Pierre, the two of us bound together by what we have done to this country. Au revoir, my love. You will be in my heart until I die. Imelda. Suddenly everything made sense. My father had been working undercover for the government. He was one of the good guys after all. He and Imelda must have fallen in love. She'd found out who he really was, so he had to leave. It had broken her heart, but she had never revealed it to anyone. I knew I couldn't either. Whatever he was doing, he'd had good reason to keep it secret. I decided I would respect that and tell nobody.